the bedrooms will have to uh, kind of sort of read the... How are you feeling about the bedroom anyway? It's a spacious interior, extremely comfortable. Recreation's fully satisfied. The ascetic has an awful bedroom. Alright, so how you doing? Awful bedroom minus four. I had to sleep in an awful room. Yeah, because it's, it's overall like a bit small and stuff. Yeah, only five. It's impoverished. It's rather tight. Only 23 space. But, if we clean it up and we make it a little more impressive, we could maybe get by with rooms like that. Just these little shotgun house type deals. And then that way I can also cool them pretty easily through venting and the air conditioning and all that. Speaking of. Yeah, that's doing good. No problem there. You were just busting out so many meals. Can we, uh... Quickly get a stockpile set down here. Critical importance. Allow fresh. Not rotten, though. Raw food. And animal corpses. Hell, also meals. Just all of it. And then the butcher table. We can reinstall. I suppose. We can make a... New light for you. And also give you a light down here. This will be for the stove. Which we'll reinstall. So for now you gotta go through, but after we get all this mined out... You could just access the freezer that way and it's significantly easier. And then we can do dining room up here, which we have an okay amount of wood. We'd still like to get the water wheels going at some point. So I don't really know if I want to spend the wood straight away. So maybe we do... stone? Looks like we've got a good bit of granite. Yeah, 95. That'll work. And maybe I do, like, wooden dining chairs or so, instead of stools, because dining chairs are a lot more comfortable. They're overall a much better bet. Uh... Then we can rip out the limestone tiling in here and move it over. I know it's a bit of work. The freezer can just be concrete, though. That doesn't need to be very fancy at all. But I'll be more than happy with that. Concrete, we can shift across. Keep the road going a little bit. Minor break risk, what's wrong with you? Recreation, starve night owl in daytime. Are we like... Yeah, you're bored with dexterity. Okay. Yeah, we gotta get like proper joy. The one's not enough. Yeah, poker? Poker is fun. You guys like poker, right? We got a bit of cloth for it. I don't know if you guys need to sit for poker or if it's okay. As is. Do that first. Yeah, it used to be like one horseshoe pin was totally fine. Like, yeah, it had diminishing returns for recreation, but you could still put up with it forever and they'd be fine with it. Yeah, I don't know if people are actually going to be using that or not. I think I need to have some stools. So, fine. Um, it's, a, it's a bit weird, but I don't know. Dossix, you want to bash these out? Yeah, you need, the, you need the seat for sure. Okay. But that is considered cerebral play. For a big group of people, you just have to- you just gotta dodge the horseshoe pin every now and then. That's okay, though. A little bit of dexterity mixed in. They'll be alright with it. And the wall... Yeah, not up there. Down here. That's the one. And this whole pocket is... I don't know. Doesn't need to be there. 
I guess I could move the research bench to be over on this side of everything, I suppose. For the moment, though, cancel. Mine up the cool stuff, sure. But the rest of it, I don't really care too much about. Yeah, that's fine. So we still have some steel and components on hand. The temp here is maintaining. The meat has moved in. The corpses have yet to be moved in. I don't really have anybody for hauling yet. I, I guess technically Zion is handling that a bit. Dasix is going for a table. Or is he? No, he's eating in just, just the side of the room. Oh, okay. Whatever you need, man. Uh, flooring? We're gonna just go with concrete in here. Rip up the old floor and go concrete. Because we're almost at the point where I don't actually need this to be very fancy at all. Because there's not going to be a whole lot in it. It's kind of just like a little workshop joy room in a moment. You know? Man, all the fucking bison are here. They'll make me hunt your asses too. Come on. What's your, like, aggression chance? Are you basically just... No, you're a little more hostile. 10% chance to attack when harmed. They're a little more defensive. Man, this fucking animal's showing up for my hay grass. Get out of here! Ah, how fast are you? 4.7. Scary. Oh, we're 4.42. At least Lua's. Or uh, somebody like Daddy Loader? You're healthy and everything. Yeah, 4.6. Okay, they're not a whole lot faster than us, but they are faster than us. So if they group in rage, we're going to have a slight problem. Butcher table? Yeah, that got moved. You remember the bills? You did. Cool, cool. Are you doing... Yeah, in a local area. Good. Because I don't want the butcher hauling ass across the map to butcher, necessarily. Unhappy nudity, Dossix. Okay. Whoa. The boom low brought it away. That's not good. How is it that you weren't, um... That you weren't butchering? I'm not sure on that. Like, what else would you have been doing that whole time? A bit of a shit run for all that right now. Can we get the corpses hauled, please? And the uh, just a dumping stockpile over here. Critical importance, clear all for the rotten, non-fresh colonists. Just all the corpses except colonist corpses, because those we need to bury. Rotten, not fresh. In there. So they have a better home than in here. Yeah, perfect. Just get over there. Oh well. That's okay. If we had butchered them all and everything at that point, I think we would have been in trouble. Or no, we wanted to wall up across like this. Except you get a door. Down there. And yeah, we'll scoot the lamp slightly for you. There. So currently, you guys are spoiling in 10, 11 ish hours. Zion, what are you working on? Playing some poker? When you're done with that, 
Come butcher, please. Dasix going apeshit with that. Work on the limestone walls. So we can turn this freezer back into a freezer. Zion, are you cooking? Butchering. Okay. No, don't consume it. Don't consume it. Butcher it, please. Yeah, five days. Refrigerated, though, to be fair. But I think butchering it, it gives it like a new lease on life, kind of. Okay. And you're heading off. Reki the Voshbear, can you work on the walls a bit? Because you had a bit of construction skill. Yeah. Ten burning passion. Like, you're, you're pretty much there. And then the steel door, please. Fantastic. And floors, we're going to just concrete the floor here. With the freezer, and the rest of it could just be the rock floor, that's okay. Awesome. And then the rest of that gets smoothed out. So the freezer works, we're currently at minus four. They're both at high power usage though, you see. Because they're both hauling ass to maintain minus four, when really one could do the trick. So if I bring this up to just minus one, we're still maintaining freezing. Um, but it's low power usage, so it's only using 20 watts instead of the 200 watts of a higher one. And we have a bit of unroofing happening here because of the... Uh, yeah, because the mountain wall it was a bit open there. But... We can build a roof area. You're already on it, but just to make sure it stays. Okay, cool. So that's the freezer basically done. The general dining area basically done. We need a cooler and a couple vents to keep things nice and happy inside. The bedrooms will have to kind of redo, which I'll likely mine this out to make a little more room for it all, and we'll just end up doing these shotgun house type deals. And uh, line them up there while we continue getting all of this done. For workshops. Speaking of, who's doing research? I'm always forgetting. I'm I'm not used to just having three people. I typically go for a start where I've got more, so it's it's a bit rough getting going, actually. Yeah, da six. I think I switch you back over to two. Arkita Voshbear, continue mining then constructing. That'll be okay. I don't have a whole lot left for you to mine, so that's all right. We need to get some construct uh, research going again, so we can get microelectronics. So I can get a trading post, a trading beacon. And then the, um, the actual nice research bench, because this research bench just gives you still the 75% research speed, whereas the nice research bench is 100%. So we're actually researching a bit slower than we should. Alright. Nice. I think we'll throw in a couple lights. Just so I can see what's in here. Because otherwise it does get really dark. Your light still needs to be scooted. We need lighting up here. Three meals rotted away in search. Oh, we didn't have everything hauled. Okay. I guess the... Herbal medicine's in rough shape. Why? I guess it was outside for a little while. Uh, we can do a crafting spot? Or do I have just a generic crafting table? Tailor bench, art bench. I still have the unhappy nudity, right? So we gotta get a tailor bench at some point. I suppose we'll get you one. Out of wood? No. Steel, I think. Steel's oddly more accessible for me right now. And down the road you can get the mineral scanner type thing, which is nice because it, it leads you to technically infinite materials. You just work it slowly over time. And it just discovers more and more and more as time goes on. Although, we do have a lot of wood out here. It just needs to be brought in. There's 560 wood right there. Although, again... That's that's actually enough for the water milk generators. We'll unforbid those to see if that even works then, and that'll, that'll be the, uh, the wood used. Alright. Although, no, hold on. Wood dining chairs. Because I wanted to do those. 
Oops. Uh, yeah. Okay. And we'll see if the two lights down there is enough of them or not. Flooring still needs to be ripped out over here. Is that... Yeah, it's still, still queued up. Just taking a little while. It's a lot of work for one guy to do. Yeah, the concrete looks a little bit strange, doesn't it? Well, I might just go ahead and concrete. <laughs> concrete the whole thing, just so it's uniform. <laughs> that doesn't look great. We can take that apart and uninstall these stools. The steel hand tailor bench. Um, I mean, I guess t-shirt and pants just maintain. I can take to whatever stockpile, it doesn't matter. Make them out of, like, just cloth, please. Until we have two of them. Don't count equipped, don't count tainted, look everywhere. Of only the allowed ingredients, please. And just pause it when satisfied. And unpause it when we just have one. So you're really maintaining two. And take the best stockpile, that's okay. Requires 40 cloth, that's that's fine. I don't know if that actually matters. Uh, oh yeah, and only look at stuff that's actually like in good shape, please. Cool. Can we copy and paste, but switch you over to pants? No. Same deal with pants, though. And that will be something for daddy loaders to do. We'll do smithing first, then tailoring, and then crafting, because it goes left to right. Yep, yep, yep. And lighting seems good. Alright. Cool. So that's the clothing taken care of a little bit. A little bit of heat stroke still going on from the heat stroke. Because it's, it's honestly not that hot, though. 28C? I don't know, man. I don't know about that. Yeah, I guess. And those stools. Where'd we throw those? Ah, oh, they're still here. We'll get those in. How are we doing? A good wood dining chair has 0.78 comfort. It's technically not good enough. I think 0.8 was the uh, the first threshold for like a comfort boost. So not not quite there. Just a normal one. 0.7. And Dasix, if I go to your needs, your comfort. Yeah, it's 78%. It's just below the threshold at 80% to get you a uh, a comfort bonus. So we technically need the next up the next step up from good, which I think is excellent. Oh well. Oh well. Unfinished pants. Oh, you want to finish those? Daddy loader. Daddy loader, please. And <laughs> yeah, doing a t shirt now. Alright. Priorities are priorities. There we go. A good quality cloth t shirt. Normal blue fur pants. Just cloth, please. God damn it. <laughs> Don't use the buffalo fur for that. Come on. What you think? Uh, the Heron Unification visiting, coming by with some stuff to trade. Coming in through the Doom Tunnel. Yeah, gross corpses. Ugh. <sighs> Uh, it's not great in there, huh? Oof, man, there. That's really... That'll really affect somebody coming through there. Man, if they're, like, volatile or something... 
Brawler has ranged weapon. There you go. Yeah, you ain't doing so great. Uh, Zion was the top one. Yeah, Zion. But can I get maybe Dasix? If we make a cool hat for Dasix, I think it's a cowboy hat, right? Can I make this priority and get that done? Please, please, please. Who was tailoring? Oh yeah, Daddy Loader was. Please do that real fast out of... Ideally just... Well, can you do cloth? You can't do cloth, but you need 25 ingredients. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, sorry. So, whatever you gotta do. Blue fur it is. Make that up real fast. We'll get that to Dasix and we'll use Dasix for trading them because the cowboy hat gives you a slight social boost. Fine, fine. And there we are. Force wear it. Gives you plus 10% social impact. Nice. I don't know exactly if that affects uh, prices. I think I remember it doing so. Let's see if you take the hat off. Trade with Doc. Package surviving molds for sixteen fifty six. Sixteen fifty six still okay, so maybe not. All right. They don't have anything that I actually want, so we're selling off a lot of the stuff that's not in great shape. Slash, I don't care about because short bows like they're not very good. The recurve bow, I guess I'll keep. I guess I'll keep the two recurve bows because they're pretty cool. They're normal, but not the poor one. And the excellent short bow, I think we'll sell that as well. It's only for 9 silver, which isn't great, but if we're keeping the recurve bows, that'll be fine. The clothing actually sells pretty well. Not the stuff that's in terrible shape, but like the cloth travel wear that we got, it's only poor 93%. It's already like 50 silver. Like, holy shit. That's quite good. So we're doing that. We're making 100 silver out of the deal, out of their 250. Again, they don't have anything that I want. They've got four packaged survival meals and a medicine and a camel hair duster. So, yeah. We'll just accept and leave it at that. And haul the silver in real quick, please. Good stuff. I shifted this around a little bit, so we're at minus five and minus two, because it's kind of a big room and it was actually having a little bit of trouble maintaining. I might need a third one. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and just do a third one just so it's done. Do we have the steel for it? 90 steel. Yeah, we'll have enough. Well, would have. Uh, <laughs> good, good job, Rakita Voshbear. I'm proud of you. Mm, we still got to get that one done, too. And concrete that, please. Thanks. Well, we can do a bit more steel mining. There is a big lump of it somewhere nearby yeah, up here. I thought it'll work. Inspired trade, Dasix. Significant trade price bonus when closing your next trade deal. Expires after eight days. And a new quest called Ship to the Stars. Right. Yeah, that thing. It's a four star difficulty one. I don't know, maybe we go for that. I never really bothered with it because I thought the ending event thing for it was like really fucking terrible and I hated it. Especially because you go through so many ambushes along the way usually. Like, it's just, it's not cool. But I never actually did a Let's Play that we ended with that, so... Maybe... Maybe we go for it this time. I don't know. Alright, so the two outer ones are minus two and the middle one's minus five. So we should be able to maintain the temp. Pretty okay now with all that. And the stockpile, we can expand a bunch. So that's that. Meal-wise, I guess you can continue doing it forever. I I don't know, until we end up getting like so much food that I don't know what to do with. That'll be okay, because I always, always, always run into the issue where we, um, we just, we ran out of food or so, and I never got around to doing that. Can we plant the smoke leaf? Why isn't this happening? Growing one, Lou. Oh, it's still disallowed. Whoops. Okay, that explains that. Yikes. That, that's, that's been like that for a while. Ahem. It's a slightly impressive dining room. It's got rich wealth. It's extremely spacious. It's a little bit ugly and a bit dirty. The ugliness sort of comes with the dirtiness, I think. Or vice versa, perhaps. 
but one day we can maybe get some art and stuff going on. Could be okay. I could also maybe go for... Oh yeah, barricades are a thing. Waist high barrier for um, like proper materials and sandbags are cloth now. Right. Um, what was it saying? Just like something basic just to get that going. Like we could go with, I don't know, probably fit in one of these things. Like they're not great, but it works. Or the pillar, which was under structure, I think, right? Because these were kind of pretty, right? Beauty 5? That's a granite one. We could go for marble. It's like, I don't know. Splash them in there somewhere. I don't know, why not? I don't know if they have a quality to them, or if they're actually just like a wall where they don't have quality at all, so it just it is what it is. But a little bit of beauty will help out a lot. Heck, we could even probably go jade. Yeah, you could. You could go with a jade column. 22 beauty right there. Up from... Up from 8. It's quite nice. Maybe you get, like, a jade column in here. <laughs> At the foot of the bed, just kind of there, hanging out. <laughs> I don't know. Still gotta fix your room up. Man, we got a lot of stuff to do. Everybody's kind of spread thin with all their uh, tasks and priorities. Not great. Right, how's that doing now? Yeah, it's pretty. It's clean. Akita Vashvir is finishing up the last one. It's still, it's still pretty. We just needed the one. It's very impressive now, though. So that's nice. That's good. So Zion, having eaten in a very impressive dining room. Well, it still says decent. Oh, there we go. No, it still says decent. Man, it's better than decent. Slightly impressive rec room. I suppose. <laughs> uh oh, psychic drone. It's only a low one. Every male condos feels a wave of anxiety and anger. So Zion, Rakita Vashbe, Lou, Daddy Loader, not Dosix. That's it. Everybody else though. Zion mixed in with your bond and animal dying. And being apparently soaking wet and sleeping in the heat. What were you like super sweaty? Probably. I think we ought to redo a bedroom or two or so. I think it's getting to be time to do that. Mine out. Yeah, I mean, I guess just mine that out. We'll cancel the plants. We'll just move where we put the research bench. That'll be then here, I suppose. And this can be just one little workshop and then a second workshop out here. If you guys smooth that at like a decent pace, I could maybe turn that into a temporary barracks while we get the housing fixed up. Because then we can do the, um, you know, like cool air conditioning and everything. Although, April, May is fall. Uh, what what day are we in? Oh, it's the 13th. Well, it should be getting colder, actually. We should be going into fall soon. Or no. Yeah, fall soon. April, May. I think so, if I'm reading that right. Because there's 15 per, so yeah. Well, maybe we'll be okay. But that is definitely something we got to get going with. And come winter, we might actually need to do, uh, switch them around to heating. Hello? You bothered by all the scrapping and, uh, scraping and scratching going on as we smooth everything? No, actually. The door opening is what did it, minus one. Well. And the benefit of doing this is the smooth flooring turns it from a negative one to a plus two. And the walls, I think, are minus two to plus one? I don't know if those are as good or not. But that's a cool thing. Really helps out of the room a lot. And then you'll have a really cool, awesome room that nobody else has, and your greediness will be satisfied. You damn bastard. More spacecraft. That's a bit far away, though. No, thank you. There we go. Now we got Smoke Leaf going. God damn it. I can't believe we, we would have had Smoke Leaf by now. <laughs> ah, well. 